Hello, child here. He calls me his child, Dusty Rose, etc. So, how about that 2020, eh? So done. So done. For whatever it's worth, even if it's just psychological, I'm so thrilled that we're heading into a new year finally. Not very much to update at this time. Uh, still reading through 1984 and Heretics and Orthodoxy, which is nothing like I expected it to be based on the title. Uh, and the Book of Sorrows, which I really, 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 really need to update on. <laughs> Uh, I think I will update on that soon. But in the meantime, I also wanted to uh, throw two things out there. And the first thing is, here are other places you can find me doing other things. Because YouTube is frankly a pretty small fraction of what I do. The place where I am probably the most active is going to be Tumblr, under the same username. And I will put the link there below. It's my personal blog. Well, I mean, it's not just my personal blog, because on Tumblr, you know, often you find, like, neat things and you reblog them. That's just kind of... It's kind of like if Facebook and Pinterest had a baby, except it was very dysfunctional. Like, more dysfunctional. That's probably Tumblr. So I'll reblog a lot of things that I find to be interesting, but I also, uh... I mean, I talk about myself on there. Um, for what it's worth, I post my writings on there. And speaking of my writings, I write fanfiction. I write it on Archive of Our Own and fanfiction.net and Wattpad and Tumblr. And I've written for several different movies, really mostly movies, here and there. But the main two obsessive fandoms that I write for are Invader Zim and a little known fandom called Mystery Skulls Animated. And just so you know, that fandom is super easy to join. Very little amount of uh, original content, you know, will get you right into it. I'm just gonna... So I'm gonna leave links to my profiles, but I'm also going to leave links to the four music videos. It's just four music videos that tell an incredible story. So four music videos, I'm gonna leave a link to them also down there. Uh, along with an explainer video for the first three, in case it's because it goes by a lot of detail in those videos, it goes by really fast. But there's an incredible story there, and I have written way too much fan fiction for that. <laughs> in addition, I do a lot of arts and crafts, uh, paint little wooden figures, mostly crochet, hats, scarves, blankets. Uh, I also make little wire trees, as an example. This one, uh. I haven't decorated it yet, but uh, as an example of one that's been uh, sitting around waiting for me to hang things off of it and decorate it. Uh, wire trees. Uh, and of course you've seen me wearing the hats every now and then. I might make that a thing. I don't know. It's just kind of fun. I mean, I'm not wearing them, you know, out very much, so maybe I just wear them here. Um, anyways, I have a shop for all that. And everything gets washed before it's before it leaves here. So uh, I have a shop on Kofi. I will put the link for that down below also in my Kofi shop. I know it's pronounced coffee, but it's not spelled like the word coffee, so I keep calling it Kofi since it's K-O-F-I. I have a Twitter. Please don't bother looking for it. I don't do brevity, so you know, occasionally I'll put something there, but mostly my Twitter collects dust. <laughs> have Facebook, but I really only connect with people I know on Facebook. I try to keep that, you know, as a policy. I also have DeviantArt and Instagram. Mostly that's where, you know, my, my arts and crafts go, my paintings. Oh yeah, I do paintings too. And uh, digital art is harder for me to put on Instagram, so I put that on my DeviantArt. Links to those below. Also, just recently, I picked up embroidery. I'm just starting. I'm really excited. This is a really satisfying craft. The front looks cool. The back is a mess! It's kind of like the writing process, too. That's about all I can think of in terms of other places to find me. I have profiles scattered around on the internet, but frankly, I'm the sort of person who occasionally I will start trying to use a platform, and if it doesn't work for me, I just let it collect dust forever. So, you know, you'll find I mean, Pinterest, Pearl Trees, back when they were trying to get off the ground, and various things like that, sure, you're gonna find my username, but you're not gonna find me active. Anyways, there's about 320 or so, a little over 320 of you now, 
thank you. I had, this is, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just reading. And this is really cool. And it's really fun to see what you guys say. Encouraging. Thank you. Uh, having fun with this. I'm still nervous about some books that I want to put in the pipeline, but you know, I, I gotta face that at some point. So the other thing is, I was just wondering if you guys have any questions. I mean, I tend to answer them in comments and stuff, but I don't know, if I collect enough questions together, maybe I do an answer video. I kind of like interacting. Um, I don't always know how to interact. You know, somebody says, you know, this is great, I like it, I'm like, thumbs up! Because I have no idea where to take that. But uh, I do enjoy interacting, not arguing. I don't want to argue. I don't want to fight. Really don't want to pick a fight. Don't want to continue a fight. I won't interact with that stuff. But, you know, I like interacting, talking, you know. So uh, if you got any questions, drop them here. Maybe I'll respond to the video. We'll see. See where this goes, yeah? So I'm going to wish you... Uh, the following things based out of what I celebrate, but behind the wish is an extension of warmth from the way I celebrate to the way you celebrate. So happy Hanukkah and Merry Christmas, and I hope you have a gentle new year. May you find peace and joy in the coming year in unexpected places and in unexpected ways. I hope that joy surprises you, and when it does, grab it. Don't let go. Good night.